Well, welcome to this session on Tableau and in this short video we're going to uh, to discuss some several uh, data tasks that you can perform in Tableau to get your data ready for analysis and uh, as you know Tableau like all other data analytics tools uh, requires some well structured data and uh, clean data for you to optimize your work and therefore, I'll be showing you some three uh, tasks that you can perform in Tableau to get your data ready. And the first thing, I have uh, three data sets here. The first data is named Data Interpreter. Uh, basically, we're going to see how we can apply the Data Interpreter feature in Tableau uh, to clean our data or to prepare our data for analysis. And after that, with the same data, we're going to do uh, rather to perform uh, a task called uh, pivoting data, which is basically converting columnar uh, cross tab data to columnar data uh, to simplify our analysis. And also, we will look at the second data, which is about splitting fields. Sometimes uh, you need to split uh, uh, fields, for example, this customer name. Maybe you want to do some analysis based on the first. Uh, name of the customer. So we'll see also how we can split fields in Tableau. And lastly, we'll also see how sometimes how can we group data as a way of cleaning data, especially in cases whereby maybe data has been renamed in uh, in a way, in a different way, uh, same, rather same data or same um, uh, same fields, right? Or rather same same items for that case are uh, named differently. How can we uh, clean such data by grouping it? That is something also we're going to look at it. And therefore, let me go to Tableau and uh, connect an Excel file. Let me begin by data interpreter for, the, for that case. And we're going to see when I connect to this data, <coughs> sorry, uh, you're going to see Tableau uh, is unable to identify what should be our the column headers and you can see them are appearing as part of the data simply because uh, uh, from our data the original data is because there are some spaces some empty uh, rows and columns right before the main data and that's the reason why our data looks this way and basically when tableau detects uh, availability of sub tables in the data uh, you will see that the data interpreter feature will be activated there will be available and therefore one of the easiest way to overcome this we can use the data interpreter feature uh, to clean our data and as simple as that you can see now my data is clean and I'm ready now to to jump into my analysis and now when you look at this data, this data basically is about um, uh, is some dummy data on individuals' favorite social media channel. And if I were to answer a question, a simple question like which uh, is the popular social media channels for all these guys here, you're going to find that uh, to be able to answer that questions, I need to perform some other. Uh, some other tasks here and therefore I want to introduce you to uh, something called pivoting data and basically pivoting data is transforming data from a cross tab basically what we have here to have a columnar data which uh, is much easier for analysis and to do that I select the first column from where I want to begin my pivoting I'll hold down the shift key and select my last column and I will pivot my data and by pivoting you're going to find that all the social media channels are put on the same bucket same column and the responses those people who said uh, I like this uh, social media their responses are on the same bucket the same column here and therefore I'm going to go for my analysis I go to sheet 2 and to do my analysis, I will drag uh, pivot field names to the rows and pivot field values to the columns. I can sort, I can level, and I can tell at a glance and quickly that YouTube 
and the highest responses followed by Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and the last was uh, LinkedIn, and uh, those were the last social media channels. And basically, those are a few tasks that are uh, simple tasks you can perform uh, to get your data ready for your analysis. And another task you can perform, let me call it uh, splitting data. Splitting data. And to perform that, uh, or rather to demonstrate that, I'm going to connect uh, to data named uh, split multiple fields. And here I have my data. And now here, let's say we want to perform a simple analysis whereby we want to answer this question. Uh, which uh, is the common first name for our customers, right? And to be able to answer that question, it means we need to split this field. So how do we split fields in Tableau? To split fields in Tableau is very simple. I'll go to the column and into split. Under that arrow available there, I can right click or use the, the drop menu. And I'll go to custom split, right? And I want to split the first, uh, the first element of that field and the separator I'm going to use is a space so I press space and okay and you see now this is my first customer name and now I'm good to go for my analysis whereby my analysis is which uh, what is the common name uh, for my for my customers and uh, let me drag number of columns to a number of records to columns and sort and uh, label them and I can tell friend is a common name followed by Bernard, Berry, Berry and Anne and that's another task that you can perform to make your analysis easy in Tableau that is splitting fields and then the last uh, simple there are so many but I'm just, I've just picked a sample of them just to demonstrate is grouping data and I'll demonstrate that by connecting to a grouping data here and basically if you look at this uh, dummy data here we have uh, a field called continent and basically it's going to contain uh, all different continents we have uh, on this planet earth and if you look at the continent Africa has been renamed in different uh, ways. There's Africa, there's Africa with K, there's Africa, and all these fields mean the same thing. So sometimes we can perform, or rather we can group our data to make our data ready for analysis. And to group uh, this data, I can right click or use the drop down menu there and create a group and basically i'm going to select the fields i need to group here it's africa 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 and i need to group these fields together and i'll give them now the name they're going to use africa and when i click ok you're going to see tab is going to create now a new field uh, which is uh, the grouped field and now in my analysis now I can use my grouped field to do my analysis and there I have my analysis and basically now what uh, extent of uh, if we used the previous field let me replace it by uh, let, let me just show it here continent replace it there so you see how our data looks like but when we use our group field now our analysis is much uh, more tight and more understandable because uh, by grouping those fields we we did some uh, kind of data cleaning uh, making our data uh, more uh, ready for analysis and uh, making it even more understandable therefore those are just a uh, few tasks that you can perform uh, to make your data ready for your analysis and i think 
If you like the video and you like to receive more of this video, kindly subscribe to the channel. If you have questions or something that you want us to cover next time, kindly leave it under the comments and we're going to look at that.